All right, first step is to ensure that your image that you would like to scroll is set to repeat and that the component that you're using is raw image and not just image as raw image gives us access to the UV rect. All right, create a C-sharp script and call it scroller. Begin by removing the start method as we don't need it. Grab our references. First one will be a raw image reference. Next we'll need a pair of floats for our speeds, one X and one Y. In our update, let's update our UV rect equals to new UV rect. And we will do position, we will do our current UV rect position plus new vector two, and we'll feed in our X and our Y times that by time dot delta time. And then for the size, we will use our normal size. Let's check that out. Sc attach it to our scroller, our scrolling image. Um, feed in the reference. Maybe something like that might look good. There we go. Hope you learned something. If you did, give it a like, subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you next time.